what are these tanks doing out in the middle of the Southern California desert? Well, today we're uh, about halfway between Indio, California and uh, Desert Center, California on, I may not pronounce this right, you know me, Shariaco Summit. Is that close? Um, we're actually at a museum. It's a General Patton Memorial Museum. And I was by here two years ago, uh, and I just got a glimpse of it from the desert, and, or I mean from the interstate, and I, I was on a mission, and uh, well, I passed by. I wanted to stop and, and see what it was about, and I really thought it was just maybe like a graveyard for old tanks, and maybe a little memorial, but there's a lot more to it than I realized now that I'm here. Uh, these tanks, they actually have one here that runs. These tanks obviously are missing some parts and uh, sit out here in the back, out in the back 40, so to speak. By the way, we are leaving California today. By the end of this video, I expect to be out of California. And I don't think I'll be back in California for quite some time. So here's some other vehicles that are out here in the back 40 that have seen better days, but there are some uh, really n uh, nice ones around uh, and in inside the museum. We're probably going to make pretty short work of this video, actually. I hate to rush through here, but I might a little bit. Yeah, lots of parts missing. And it appears to be a chapel, a uh, chapel here of sorts. And I, uh, I have to apologize, I might show my ignorance here uh, in this video a little bit. I'm not, uh, even though my grandfather was uh, in World War One. geez, I think I had an uncle that went to Germany and at some point for some reason, uh, I don't know what the, conflict or, or what was going on not very close with that particular uncle and uh, so I'm not really from a military family I was never in the military and uh, I'm just not real educated in this area not that I don't absolutely appreciate those that have served and do serve um, oh check this out um, it has a California license plate on it and it was built by the International, the International Harvester Company. These seats had to be super cozy, comfy, right? Wow. It'd be interesting to see this all restored. It's kind of late in the day. So we're going to pick up some odd shadows here. Oops. Well, it's written on this one that the fluids have been drained. See, okay, see all these tracks? See all these tracks here? <laughs> one of these guys runs. And I'm going to bet it's this one over here. Well, the tracks actually go to that one. So, it's pretty evident that, that one runs. I think you can go for tank rides uh, for about $200. I think I heard somebody say that somewhere. And this one here too obviously runs. So, I guess they have two of them that operate. And I think by law they have to somewhere have to uh, breach the gun so it is absolutely no question is inoperable please do not climb on vehicles so being as this was um, the George General George Patton Museum. I bet it's pretty likely this was his personal car. The 
การลักเกสอ่ะไซด์ว่าเป็นรถรบแคบเจ้าหน้าที่นี่ฉันไม่แน่ใจว่าเขาเป็นคนที่ดีที่สุดในโลกนี้ฉันไม่แน่ใจว่าเขาเป็นคนที่ดีที่สุดในโลกนี้ฉันไม่แน่ใจว่าเขาเป็นคนที่ดีที่สุดในโลกนี้ฉันไม่แน่ใจว่าเขาเป็นคนที่ดีที่สุดในโลกนี้ฉันไม่แน่ใจว่าเขาเป็นคนที่ดีที่สุดในโลกนี้This stuff is his um, was patent, you know, personal stuff. I think he obviously he liked the ski. I don't know why. I'd love to have one of these in operating condition. Of course, patent I think is. Uh, mostly known for his uh, service in World War II, he was a famous photograph. General Patton there in the center. I think he has. Uh, there's some stuff here as uh, Patton as a younger fella, um, horseback riding. And I think this is uh, his saddle. Some models built here. Let's just check this out. <laughs> That's pretty impressive. Yeah, I hate to rush through here, but if you're ever in the the area, uh, there's lots of information, lots of history here. Uh, I think I. Passed up a wall that had all kind of uh, uh, rifles and handguns, and you know of the era. Lots of photos and articles to go through. Uh, I wish I would have seen this uh, sign in other places. It's on my way out that I see it. <laughs> I guess I got lucky. Now they do have. Where is it at? They do have some, and there's a statue of uh, General Patton up there. They do have some uh, remembrance walls over here with mentions of those that served and gave the ultimate. Uh, this is the Korean, uh, the Korean remembrance wall. And I believe on the other end where we're parked at is uh, um, well, let's go over and see. And I won't forget to get Bella in this video. So I know there's the Vietnam Remembrance Wall over here, and uh, there's the Defenders of Freedom Remembrance Wall. And there's Bell patiently waiting for me. So there really is a lot more to this uh, museum than I realized when I just, you know, drove by up here on Interstate 10 uh, two years ago. Bella, are you ready to get out of California? Hmm. Hmm. Are you ready to get out of California? 
We'll get, we'll get going. Okay? We'll get going. Ah, you're a good girl. <laughs> she is such a good girl. Well, we are on the road. Interstate 10 headed east towards Arizona. I don't know, another 15 miles to get out of California. I'm not stopping until we're in Arizona. And we've got a whole lot of this going on. I don't think she likes the camera sometimes. It's like, what are you sticking that thing on my face for? Come on, Bella. Come on. Come on, this way. I think Bella, it might be due for a... Hey, what are you doing, crazy? She's probably due for a little potty break. Go on. Go on. Well, we made it. We're in Arizona. California's over there. Arizona's over there. Yeah, California, Arizona. Don't look much different, does it? <laughs> yeah, we traveled Interstate 10. Uh, there she goes. In the Ehrenberg, Arizona. And I think we're actually going north from here up to Parker. Maybe, uh, you know, we've been out in the boondocking for so long, it's, uh, sometimes it's nice just to see a fast food restaurant. <laughs> and there was one over in, uh, there was several. Carl Jr.'s, Burger King, Denny's, all that. And I've been hungry for something to eat out. But I was not starving until I got to Arizona. No distractions. Come on, girl. Come on. Come on. Uh, but I, anyway, we might go north up to Parker. I think it's another 30 or 40 miles. Uh, maybe stay up at the Blue Water Casino tonight. Uh, maybe get something to eat up that way somewhere. Study some maps later on and tomorrow. Decide what we're going to do for, at this point. It's time to change things up a bit. That's what's going to happen. Anyway, maybe I'll end the video here. I don't know what the rest of the day brings. Let's get Bella up here and then we'll close. Come on, girl. Come on, you're done. I seen. I seen you as done. Good girl. Come here. Good girl. Good girl. Uh -uh. Being good. All right. There might be some interesting travel plans coming up. I'm, I'm, I got an idea. Uh, so, uh, anyway, thanks for coming along today. As always, like, comment, share, subscribe. I'll see you soon. Let's go, girl. Come on, this way. Inside. <laughs>